and welcome back to my YouTube channel. This is my 6am summer morning routine which I have been loving now that I'm on school holidays. It's my first time speaking today so excuse the way my voice sounds. I also need to do my skincare and drink some water before I start my day. But I've woken up nice and early. It's currently 6.21am. Today is a Tuesday which means it's a weekday so I'm a bit more productive and energised in the morning. This morning routine should be really fun. We might do a little bit of yoga and I've just been loving waking up early and cherishing the quiet time while the whole house is asleep spending it journaling reading and just really having that time to myself and making waking up early something that I look forward to and enjoying waking up early without feeling rushed without having to go to school or having anything on and it just sets me up with a really good headspace for the rest of my day it looks like it should be a beautiful day outside so we're going to have a beautiful day a beautiful morning there's only 20 days till Christmas so the countdown begins I've got some Christmas decorations on my bed I was going to wear my Christmas pajamas last night but they were in the wash so I had to settle for my gingerbread shorts but I need a drink ASAP so let's go fill up our water bottle and then do our skincare Cause baby love sunscreen. I mentioned it in one of my vlogs that has either been uploaded or will be uploaded after this video and it's the one I usually use but it's the Sensitive Protect and they've just bought it out and it is a lot better than my other one because I can't feel it at all on my face. This is the one that I usually use at the moment but this is the one that I have started using for the same price. I honestly really like them both but I thought why not try this one. And once again it's just from the brand Nivea and I try to wear SPF all year round but especially in my summer morning routine it's such a key part as I'm spending all day every day outside a lot of the time it's one of the best ways you can protect your skin and if you haven't got a super complicated skincare routine which you absolutely do not have to I like only use three products and have done that for like five years SPF 50 is amazing just to use even if you don't do skincare so I just put it on every day when I do my skin care so it's not like an extra step in my day if that makes sense and I try to do my gua sha when I can but let's be real it doesn't happen every day some days I'm in a rush and my gua sha is just a very unnecessary step in my eyes now I feel like a glazed donut ready to start my day it honestly makes me feel incredible doing my skincare first thing in the morning but now I'm going to move on to my favorite part of my morning which is where I sit outside or indoors and I just journal and read and have a bit of quiet time to myself before I eat breakfast or move my body and it's kind of where I set my intentions for the day and just have a really good think about how I want to spend my day what I want my mindset to be like a lot of the time I'll do some breath work some affirmations and as I said earlier the days where I am in a bit of a hurry this is obviously sped up but today I have a bit more time so I'm gonna really soak it all in and spend like a good like 45 minutes or like hour doing this but if you have school or work at the moment and you want to incorporate something like this into your routine maybe just do like five minutes of meditating or five minutes of journaling because you can use all these healthy habits and put them in your routine it just just depends how much time you have and you kind of have to adapt them to your life because no one's life is the same so let's go have a really nice rest of our morning Rising by Taylor Jenkins Reads.
Now that I've sort of had my time in the morning, I've been up for about an hour and a half. I've journaled, read, did my skincare. Before I make breakfast and do my movement for the day, I like to just go on my phone for like 10-15 minutes. This stops me going on it during the day a lot as well. It's currently 7.37 a.m. and I'll just respond to any messages that I've gotten overnight, any emails, because as much as it's good to restrict your screen time, it's also a day and age where it's kind of a non-negotiable to go on your phone at least once a day to check messages or for work things. So I'm going to set a 15 minute timer for myself and do that and then we're going to make some breakfast. For breakfast, I've just made one of my favorite go-to smoothies, especially in the summer. I do a gluten-free wheat big, frozen banana, a chocolate smoothie bomb, and some soy milk. Usually I would add some spinach too, but we ran out. I've been loving this summer experimenting with smoothies for breakfast. Morning active wear fit today. I just have my white Stax crop, my Nike Pros, and my cotton on puffer jacket over the top. Part of feeling like I've had a good movement session or just feeling put together is having nice active wear. So I really encourage you to maybe for the new year invest in some new active wear because not only will it motivate you to get out moving and be productive, but it will also make you feel just so good within yourself. And then I've just put my hair up in a little bit of a bun because today is not kind of a rest day but it's just stretching because I have my dance dress rehearsal this afternoon so I just want to like move my muscles, maybe practice a couple of my dances and I've been trying to get a lot better at yoga but I found this great stretch on YouTube made for dancers and it makes me feel so amazing before I have to dance. So that's what I'm going to do, it's about 35 minutes but let's go stretch. Sometimes my movement is yoga, Pilates is a walk. If I'm at school it might be nothing because I have dance or training that night. It really just depends. I go with the flow, see what feels good and I think it's really important to move your body in a way that you enjoy as well. It doesn't always have to be a certain way or the way that society tells you to. It is still like the most beautiful day outside. I'm not going to bother getting changed because I have my dress rehearsal this afternoon so I'm just going to be wearing my active wear anyway. So with that being said, that is kind of my summer morning routine, waking up at 6am, reading, journaling, having a good brekkie, doing some form of movement. Usually at this time I would get dressed for the day and then put a little bit of effort into my appearance if I felt like it. But as I just said, I will have to get ready this afternoon to go out later tonight. So this is is how I will look for the next three hours or so. I am so excited for the content this month. I am doing a week of Vlogmas where I will be vlogging every single day and I am so excited for it. I also have another summer vlog guide series episode coming out where I like live out my best summer. So if you did enjoy please give it a big thumbs up, subscribe, all my social medias are always in the link down below if you want to see what I get up to every single day. But I'll catch up with you guys in the next video.